area wide Diamondback moth trapping network established in Yuma. In response to the recent outbreaks of Diamondback moth through Tela Hill, Stella in Yuma, we have established a pheromone trap network designed to monitor the activity and movement of adult populations of Diamondback. PCAs have had difficulty controlling Diamondback moth and cabbage, broccoli, cauliflower since October. Wing traps with Diamondback moth. Hormone lures have been placed in Roll, Welton, Dome Valley, Gila, and Yuma Valley in locations where cold crops are presently being grown or in areas where infestations were known to occur this fall. The data we collect is not intended to indicate field infestations, as trap data is largely a reflection of adult movement. The data may reflect emergence activity of adults in adjacent fields with known infestations or provide an indication that Diamondback may be moving into fields not previously infested. If nothing else, the data may make PCAs aware of increased pest activity in some areas and encourage intensified scouting in susceptible produce fields. Diamondback moths are still active in many fields, and most recently we have observed that populations are beginning to spread into direct seeded crops that were not previously affected by diamondback. For this reason, we are tracking moth activity to monitor their activity, relative weather conditions, and crop sources. We have a historical perspective of Diamondback mod activity in Yuma. From 1998 to 2000, we established a pheromone trap network during the winter and spring in Yuma, which included Diamondback. Not surprisingly, during that two-year trapping period, Diamondback counts never exceeded six moths per trap per day at any time during the spring season. Diamondback moth have historically been a secondary pest that may cause issues in spring cabbage crops. However, in just the few weeks we've been trapping Diamondback moth since December 20th, we have had four trap locations where Diamondback counts have exceeded 10 moths per trap per day. In one location, County 9th and Avenue F, over 25 moths per day were recorded. These traps were all located at the Yuma Valley, stretching from County 21 up to County 9th Street. We will continue to monitor Diamondback trap activity throughout the season as well as trap populations activity throughout the summer to determine whether Diamondback is active when brassica crops are not available. This may give us an indication of the potential for more problems going into next season. From a historical perspective, trap counts during the summer 1999 in Yuma Valley occasionally caught diamondback moths and traps at low levels 0.2 to 1.2 moths per trap per night from July to August. We concluded at that time that many of the diamondback capture may have come in with transplant as we were uncertain whether diamondback was capable of oversummering in the desert in the absence of brassica crops. We hope to gain more insight into this past activity during summer months in Yuma this year by actively trapping throughout the area. For access to Diamondback Moth Trap Counts, please visit Area Wide Diamondback Moth Trapping Network at the Arizona Cooperative Extension website. Thank you.